Hey everyone, it's Daphne from Scrap and Create and we're working on Rain of Grace and this is page one and it's going to have a simple pocket here. This is from the 8x8 collection and this is one sheet and I just trimmed it right here where we have all these what could be cut apart tags. So we're going to um, add a small pocket and this pocket is three and one eighth by nine, three and one eighth by nine. And that number is kind of odd, but it's because that's how this piece just fit on there. So three and one eighth by nine. Score half inch on three sides to form a pocket. <clears throat> this is gonna go on the bottom of page one. <clears throat> Oops, you know what? Maybe we can trim it down to three. I'm going to take a look at that in my trimmer real quick. Let's do, no, that would be too small. Oh, I said three and one eight. That's not right. No, nope, yeah, it is. Three and one eight. It's a little bit crooked if I just straighten it up. So three and one eight by nine, that's our pocket. I'm going to score a half inch on three sides, and it's going to go on the bottom. And this is page one, build one. Mm, looking for my, here it is, hiding. My pick tool or weeding tool. I'm not positive, but I think my next project is going to be a masculine project so we can pick up some dads and grads. We'll see. I have to check in with Julie. Sometimes that will change depending on customer feedback. If there's somebody who specifically wants something or we hear from several customers, then we will alter our, our schedule. So if there's something you're looking forward to, uh, drop us a note at scrapandcreate.com. Uh, the email is contact at scrapandcreate.com. Or you can leave me a note in YouTube. And we will collate that and try to make you guys happy. Okay. So pretty. This blue is really pretty. Okay, so I'm going to put an insert in here, and I really like this paper. It's also from the 8x8 collection, so I'm going to make a 5x7 insert. Real quick. It's a little too, too small. I may put some additional inserts in, but since we're only on page one, <laughs> I got to make sure my paper um, spreads to the rest of the album. So this is just going to be a single mat, and I'm only going to decorate one side. Man, my glue thing is clogged. Must be time to clean it. because I'm pushing really hard. <laughs> I'm not getting much out. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna trim that down real quick and we'll have a nice little insert. So um, on the front, you can do a four by six and it'll have this perfect mat around it. And then on the back, you can actually put a full size five by seven. Actually, I think I might, I might leave that on there and put a uh, different decorator paper on there. If I don't have any left over, I'll trim it down um, to five. Well, good thing. It's getting hung up on the gusset down there. Okay, there we go. So in the end, this is seven, must be seven by six.
six and a half, something like that, because we've got a little bit of space here. So that is page one. I'll be back soon with page two.